Okay, so I'm doing a quick little video blog. My husband is walking by, so that's okay. Say hi, Dan. You can hi. wait. Hi. <laughs> a quick little video blog on an almost perfect day. Um, this is where I'm at on uh, March 9th, 2013. And uh, I'm good. I'm really good. Um, this day has been really incredible. I've been cooking and doing all the domestic things that I really like. There he goes again. <laughs> um, doing all the domestic things that I really like to do. And I realized after I got a few little um, things said to me on the internet that I hadn't talked about my journey in a while. It, it, my journey to wellness. In 2010, August 2010, I decided to go vegan and lose weight. I was a size 16. I was sick. I was unhealthy and I was unhappy. It is now uh, March 9th, 2013. There he goes again. <laughs> and I am a very comfortable, very curvy size 4. And on occasion... A size 2. I have a couple of pair of jeans that are size 2. I have a couple of pair of jeans that are size 6. Most of my clothes are a size 4. Um, uh, I did this because I didn't like the skin I was in. And um, I also uh, was sick. Now, you can spin it any way you like, but... The bottom line is it's my life and um, when I was heavy, I got shitty, mean comments shot at me on my YouTube, on my website. And then as I started losing weight, oh, you're losing weight. Your head looks too big. You're too thick. Stop it. Stop it. You do what? is necessary for you to do and I will do what's necessary for me to do. Um, over the last two years I've only fluctuated about eight pounds. Um, I've had a couple of surgeries when I could not work out and that had a lot to do with it. And then there, at, uh, there were a couple of moments when I was sad and I just did not want to work out. Now, there were some other things that play into it. Um, I think sometimes when my hair is up, like now, y'all see it, um, I look different. I look different. Do I look like the person <laughs> um, that y'all have come to know? You know, different things look differently. I wear my glasses not to look cute. I wear my glasses so I can see. Um, my hair, I have a lot of it. Can you see? Shh. Let's go down. It, my hair is to my waist. Can you see? Mm -hmm. Um. So when I'm cooking and working out and things like that, um, I put my hair up. You know, it's not a ploy, you know. I don't have a stylist at my house. I don't have any of those things going on. Um, but um, I, I, I hold tight. I would like to put my glasses back on so I can see y'all. I'm, I'm, for those who have not followed me, I'm 50% blind, blind in this eye because um, I have glaucoma. And don't be thinking smoking weed cures it. It doesn't cure it. It does help with um, your eye pressure. However, in my case, I don't like to do nothing that makes you hungry. Because I used to be fat. Come on, now stop it. Um, I'm very happy in the size 4 body. On occasion, I look bigger and in pictures and I look smaller some people oh you look so skinny stop it come on I'm human 
I promise you, I'm healthy. I'm strong. I have no eating disorders. I'm I'm good. I um work out. I have a life. I have a family. I cook a lot. I cook a lot. My family is not vegan. I am, but they are not. So, um I just felt the need to do a really quick video blog to um and I, trust, I'm not even looking cute. Not one bit, god damn it. And y'all are still tripping. <sighs> I encourage you to be the best person you can be, whatever that means. And do not um, pay attention to other people's fuckery. Don't do it. I didn't do it. If I did, I'd still be a size 16 laid out on my back being miserable. People want you to be miserable. They do. They don't like to see other people be happy. But sorry. I am. Hate on. Now, you don't have to hate on because I'm me, but you can hate on because I'm happy. And I have left behind, behind a lot of very miserable people who just cling on to ugliness. And I won't do it. Sorry, I ain't going to do it. I don't want to do it. Why would you want to? Ugh. Ugh. I'm so disgusted right now. Mm. I'm kind of disgusted. I'm mad. Well, I'm not really mad. <laughs> but I'm, I'm really disgusted at people who always have to, like, try to, like, bring people down to their fucked up level. Which is no level at all. So, um, I'm going to wrap this video blog up and go outside because we're barbecuing today, child. This is a good look. And um, you can throw shade if you like. No shade, no tea. Pfft, all shade, all tea, every day. Y'all know. Stop it. Stop it. Mind your business and do your thing. Be you. Everything is good. I ain't worried about you. Don't worry about me. The only thing I had to say about my journey is I have shared this journey to encourage you that if my lazy black ass could do it, you could too. Now, that being said, that is not arrogant. Is it? Really? I don't think so. If you do something to encourage other people, how is that arrogant? Shut up. Stop it. Um, <laughs> Y'all stupid sometimes. Um, I'm Epiphany. This is my video blog, and I'm going to sign out. Um, Dion Ferris is coming to my show tomorrow. Life is good. Everything's good. I'm going to go out back and barbecue and have another margarita. Y'all take care. Be well.